all right. I just had to wait for the full screen option to appear so I could uh, mute myself, unmute myself because I didn't want to alt tab this filthy full screen game. Why is it full screen? Who does that? Also, hang on. Why is my game invisible? Wait, what? I think it just turned off my monitor. Uh, it did. Who told you could do that? Elder Ring? You just turn off my screen. You can't you can't just do that. Oh now the game is on the other screen. <laughs> oh no, it's freaking out, dude. It's freaking out. Okay, I can see my game now. <laughs> Bastard. Oh, bastards. Can I can, oh hang on. Did it crash? Uh oh. Hang on, is my computer doing alright? God. My computer's not doing alright, dude. <laughs> it's like that offspring song, but instead of the kids aren't right, it's my computer. Okay, I can I can do things. Uh, although my other screen is freaking out right now, OBS is mad. Okay, it's fine now. Wow, this this game is being weird. <laughs> Very interested in seeing how this runs now. Then, yeah, it looks like my graphics. Uh, Drama just like freaked out or something. Like it's not a thing now where like everything is like um obscured up until I like hover over it, at which point it gets revealed. So like it's making Windows look totally scuffed. It's it's hard to describe. <laughs> well uh I'm I think I might be doing a brave thing here by one streaming and also to uh having default settings on. Well, I'll just just see what it's like. I, I've got recommended settings on now, apparently. Auto the best rendering settings. This is recommended, so... So, let, let's see how, how it goes. I mean, if, if they never recommended it, uh, what's the worst that could happen? <laughs> what's the worst that could happen? Hey, Hippa, hello, welcome. Welcome. Welcome to stream. That makes you old. It's nice to see you. I hope you're doing well. Uh, so this game, I supposedly, uh, like before release, it it was like the best game ever. Ten, ten out of ten from everyone. After release, a little bit dubious because it it doesn't run perfectly well on PC. I think like if you play this on PS PS4, I think. Maybe PS5 as well, I don't, uh, but I think people said PS4 specifically. Um, because I think that's the first world version that played or something, I don't know. Uh, this game runs alright. On consoles, it runs fine. Is this even on Xbox? This might not even be on Xbox, I don't, I don't know. Um, but on, on PC, it's maybe like a different story. I'm also going to be paying somewhat close attention to... Uh, my stream and seeing seeing if I'm dropping frames in the phone because I'm, I'm trying a 1080 stream uh, before for once. I haven't I haven't done a 1080 in a while. So fingers crossed, everything goes well. I like this I like this uh, armor designs. They're very cool. This guy here, particular in the, the prisoner. <laughs> What's going on here? What are you up to? I like your your whole thing really, but your shirt. It's from like it's got a very um. Remember that movie with was it Leonardo DiCaprio? That was this was that was like the, the movie he did right after Titanic, I think, right? Like he was the um, he was a teen half rob, and then they just cast him for the role where <laughs> he has like a really ugly iron mask on on the whole movie. <laughs> Looks a lot like that. And we got the wretch, of course. I'm a, yeah, a, a for male and B for female then. I, I'm assuming that's what that means there. What should we play as then? These all look fairly standard to me. It's like a the vagabond, it's like a knight thing, it's a heavy armor, medium armor sort of thing. Hero? I don't know what you are. You look, you look the, like the bandit to me, but the bandit here looks like a thief to me. I don't see what your weapon is, but I'm assuming it's some sort of knife. Astrologer. Is that a baton? Have you got like a fucking nightstick? <laughs> also, I'm not entirely sure what's going on with the armor on the nectar, buddy. They're like... 
Looks like a torture device you're carrying, though. Why is he just a samurai here? What's a, what's a samurai doing here? Who invited this guy to the party? Oh, okay, okay. They got like a bow as well. That's cool. And confessor. Like, that looks like um, an inquisitor of some sort. Can I see your stats? Can I see your stats? Oh, there we go. That's more useful to me. Uh, that looks like some sort of... Sp can I... No. Oh, explanation there, please. There we go. I can see what... No, I, I'm not allowed to actually see what they're carrying. They got... So each of these classes do start with uh, different items, but I'm not allowed to see what's actually carrying. I can just see the stats. But I can make some idea of what they're carrying from what the stats are. So what what is um arcane min? Discovery. Holy defense, vitality, sorceries, and incantations. That's wizard reading. But what's intelligence? Glintstone sorceries. This is different wizardry. <laughs> uh and faith is it's like miracles, sacred incantations, not miracles, M not miracles, the sacred inc incantations. Faith's incantations, cool. So these are your free wizard wisdom. Mine, that's a new one. FP, okay, so you're mana bar then. You get to mine for your, your bigger mana bar. Strength dex, fairly self-explanatory. Endurance, what, do you also determine equipment? Oh, you do, and stamina. Let's go. <laughs> I was so sick of um, Dark Souls 2 and 3 splitting off endurance into like three different stats. I hated that so much. Like, well, once for like dodging, and once for like stamina, and once for your equip load. It's like, oh, <laughs> just let me have the Dark Souls 1 endurance again. And this looks like it. Okay, so. Yeah, high health, balanced, strength decks. Oh, that's a dex one, then. Ah, uh, you got swords, you got double swords. That's what that's what you, you're up to, warrior. Oh, yeah, because you got uh, power stance in this one, I guess. You can dual wield. Oh, you still have two weapons. You got a halberd and, like, um, a claymore-looking thing. Like a longsword. Axe. Like strength build, then. Yeah, big, big, big strength. Yeah, so you're the, you're the bandit. You're the old bandit. And bandit is the new thief. Yeah, that's some knife and buckle. Ooh! And a little, um, is that a call, is that a recursive, is that what call it? The recur the recurve something bow? Something, something bow. Fancy bow. Baton, a dagger. Oh, probably got a spear. That's what that is. I was wondering what that was. Oh, different types of arrows, okay. Everyone's got like a, the, the fancy glowy thing. I think, I think that's probably like your humanity. I think that like restores you, probably. Prison starts with a, like an S-Stock. And they, they haven't got another thing on them. What is that? Oh, they're like a type of wizard. That's like a catalyst though. They have high int, high int on decks. I was, I was hoping for like a sicko build there. Like something that looks strange, different. I think that's the prisoner, right? I found a sicko. <laughs> yeah, that's a catalyst. That's 100% a catalyst. And of course, we're going with the dex build. Actually, wait a second. If I want to go with a sicko, it's one of these fellas, right? The fuck is that? Because I think these are going to be like, yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's go with arcane instead of int. No, your faith. Your faith. Oh, boring. Oh, I don't want to play as these guys, though. <laughs> no, your faith as well. Well, what the hell is Arcane then? The Bandit? Really? What? Hang on. Discovery. Oh, Arcane is just item discovery. This is finding shit. No, it is also sorceries and incantations. What? All right, fine. Let's go. Let's become the bandit. That that that, that does sound like, like me as well. That's something I would do. <laughs> After all, the, the first ever like Dark Souls run I did, 
I, I used a knife the whole run, thinking the knife was super good, when in fact the knife is bad. <laughs> it's very little difference here. Very little. Bandit, yeah. Keeps it. Oh, little gift. Little gift a Rony. So that's a little ring. Increase maximum HP. You used to gain many runes. The gold grace shining in the eyes of the people of the lands between. Oh, this one sounds good, I think. Gold seed washed ashore from the lands between. Set in reinforced sacred fast. That sounds really strong. Ashes of small diminutive golems. Ashes are said to hold spirits within. The fuck? That sounds like a trap. <laughs> Don't take that one. <laughs> Restrained cracked pots. The summer meld amend themselves. A container of a certain thrown items. Uh, no thank you. Two stone keys shaped like swords. Break the seal on imp statues, but it can only be used once. Oh, it's like a pharaoh stone thing. Pharaoh, pharaoh stone. I don't need that. Five sacred branches charged with the beguiling power. Nope, no nope, thank you. Do not need that. Set to originate from the demigod Michael. I do not need to disguise myself as, as pots. Five pieces of boiled prawn. Boost physical damage negation. No thank you. I do love prawns, but I don't need that. I don't know it creates likeness of a noble whose eyes have been gouged out. Attracts enemy aggression. That's like a pot then. Like a old horrible pot. Distracty thing. No, 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 no. We go with the golden seed. Easy choice. Actually, I'm, I'm curious. Um, they... Hang on. What? Oh, they have like a different, um, like, fella. Per... No, 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 this, this is just like, um... Uh, different. What do you call them? Presets. These are just pre preset fellas. Now, I wonder, like, how good uh, your... Um, the, the character created in this, because they always uh, <laughs> fuck these up in From Software games. The characters always look really dumb and bad. These don't look too bad, right? Stony face of the people of ancient dragons, among whom life is typically short. If I'm, if my skin was great like that, I don't know if I would live very long either. It's just, <laughs> I don't know, it don't look very healthy. It's very, very grey. <laughs> But let's let's become the Ash Man. Oh, voice. Can I have a sample? Perfect. Let's use that little one. Oh my god. Okay. Oh my god. Okay. <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> Oh, you don't look well. Yeah. <laughs> What's going on with your skin, dude? What happened? What do you mean facial aesthetic? Oh, it's just my aesthetic, dude. <laughs> Not a face. Apparent age? They sound years, are they? <laughs> <laughs> Can I? Uh, what, does, what does this look like? Is that you, young? I mean. Is it? Sure, there we go. Ah, okay, I see. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I found a sicko bar, dude. You may not like it, but this is actually peak femininity right here. <laughs> what? This, this bar is incredible. Form emphasis. Oh, I love these fucking bars, dude. Strong and weak. <laughs> it just scrunches him up. <laughs> oh, man. No, I like him over here. I like him over here. This, this, this is right. I can squish him up a little bit. There we go. Puck, pucker him up a little bit. He's got, like, kissy lips now. Smoochies. <laughs> Uh, face structure. Oh my god, dude. Oh no, oh my god. <laughs> oh fuck. Oh, there's so much, dude. I, I think the priests are enough for me, but I... 
<laughs> I gotta look at these. No size? Oh my god. <laughs> Fuck me. <laughs> See, the, the, at least there's one thing they let you do in these games, and it's like... I feel like... The, the, I think they let you have, like, a lot of fine control of your dude. So, they also let you, like, make incredibly fucked up guys. <laughs> Because they let you just go in like absolute extremes. <laughs> oh my god. Yeah, like, I'm like upset. Anytime I, I drag a slider to like an, an extreme, it like upsets me. <laughs> That's not too bad. Let's chill up here. We can we can look like this, and we can always we can perpetually look like we're sort of positively pleased by whatever by whatever's happening. I'm very dismayed, very disappointed. I can't believe this has happened to me. Oh God, we're gonna end up with such a fucked up dude, dude. <laughs> and I just did this, didn't I? Yeah, I did. I don't know. Do I care about his forehead very much? No, not really. Look at his eyes. You hear now. I don't know. I don't think I need to go on like every single one of these uh, options here. Can I like? Can I make your nose like wide at all? Protrusion? No, that, that can't be it. Length? No. I wanna. How do I? How do I fuck up your nose? I just want to make it like wide. I want to like give you like a nice potato nose. I guess that? No, that doesn't... That's not really what I want either. Is there no, like, nose shape option here? Come on! Come on! The menu's a little bit fiddly. Like, sometimes it doesn't, like, respond to the button, my button presses. It's like it having some... slight performance issues. There we go. That's what I'm talking about. Nice, 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 nice. Nah, that's, that's good, that's good, that's fine. There we go. That's more like it. Oh, cheekbones? God, you suddenly look like an oblivion elf, man. No, careful though. <laughs> careful. <laughs> look at me, I can chill out on these. Oh my god. What happened to you? You look so different now. Yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna keep it up here. Cheeks. Oh those are some cheeks. Gotta have some thick cheeks, man. Thick slappable cheeks. Oh my god. <laughs> oh right. so this is this is how you make the Giga Chad done. I like how greeny he becomes, though. He's very pleased with his cheekbones. <laughs> no! No! I, I, yeah, go, going to this um, this this character kind of character, yeah, this, this was a good choice. I'm, I'm very pleased. <laughs> so this is definitely an improvement of a... Even, like, Bloodborne is a game that, like, came out for the PS4, but, like, oh, the characters in it looked like ass. Like, I... I I'm, the hair is gonna be a big thing, actually. I gotta look at the hair. Because the hair was, like, so bad in previous games. And it's kinda got that, like, kinda... Um, the hair still doesn't look too convincing to me. But it's a lot better. It's got that feel to it, but it doesn't actually kinda look, look like hair. It kinda looks like plastic. But it, it's, it's getting there. I guess some of these hairstyles look a lot better. It's nice curls, actually. Nicely rendered curls. <laughs> wow. This is me after I've not had a haircut in too long. Ugh. <laughs> <laughs> uh. I think I like the idea of uh, a very curly boy. Can I? Oh, luster. 
strong. Now let's have some gentle luster. Yes. Root darkness. That was the root darkness. I guess just how strong the the a uh, dark or lighter hair is at the root. I can't really see it make a difference. Maybe with different haircuts you can see it. White hairs. Okay, that that's. It's it's radiant. <laughs> it gives you luminescent hair. You could have some white hairs, but like, there we go. Imagining if you want white hair, you probably didn't want to have the white hair option high. You want to actually have just white hair, probably. Actually, there we go. No, it still looks really weird. It still looks fucked up. It's just so glowing. I like that though. That's pretty good. It does like whoop, it just zip a little bit. It like, yeah. I'm I'm feeling some some performance things uh, right away actually. Eyeline. Is the eyeliner perceptible there? I I can't see anything. I I actually can't see eye eyeliner up here. Oh my oh my oh my god! I shadow though. Can't see that either. Can I get some blush? Oh, I can see that. I can see that. Got the, got a bit of blue on my cheeks. I don't know if I need a uh, need that though. Do I need lipstick? Already has lipstick apparently. I I came pre-built with lipstick. I guess that's what they do to like make the lips uh, that dark. Tattoo mark eye patch. Eye patch. I I also got the eye patch one option. Do I buy this? Do I buy that this guy would have an eye patch? I don't have a buy. It. I've, oh, it, this is on your body, isn't it? Mark. Maybe. Oh no, no, I, I see it now. Where is this? But oh, that's just like um, the skin blemish or whatever you call that. I like that actually. That's quite cool. It's quite cool. You see, now it's just, um, now that it's smooth. It's weird, isn't it? I don't like it. You're not supposed to be s smooth. You gotta have something. The freckles, I can buy freckles. But I, th I think I'm into these. I can buy that. Similar face. Oh yeah, so this is uh, how we can make some really fucked up guys. <laughs> It's just like a way to sort of quickly morph your guy into like different different guys. So you can kind of like make a different guy without like fiddling too much with like bars and stuff. Mm, do I buy any of these fellas? Nah, I think I think we got it. I think this is the guy. Body. I wonder if this is the same like ripped option as the other game I played recently. Well, fuck, what, what was that game? Was a game where like there was a, a muscle option, but like your guy was already like Arnold Schwarzenegger from default, and then that was zero. That was zero, and when it, you could pull out to one hundred again, <laughs> it was like so fucked up. Uh, th this is basic. This is not quite that, but this guy, this guy here is like. Pretty damn athletic for standard. <laughs> this rip, dude. Yeah, can I have some more body hair, please? Come on. Oh, I see it. I see it. It's not what I would call abundant. Yeah, so now you see it. Can I get like a little bit gray? A little bit very? 
Oh my god, it looked like a blanket. <laughs> this is a very important option because we'll definitely see this guy without armor. <laughs> what the fuck are these options? It's just a bigger head? Oh my god, no, that's, that's not right. That's also not right. Can you go like here? Huge chests. You gotta have the, the big booboo. Of course you gotta have the big booboo. Wide. Birth giving hips. Naturally. Of course. Arms. Huge. No, oh, he looks like a fucking Sasquatch. <laughs> Girthy. Very girthy. God, he's so smooth. I, I don't like a smoothies. It, it doesn't do it for me. <laughs> yeah, there we go. We got a fella. Welcome, fella. You're in. <clears throat> Is that it? What about age young? I said you to mature. Excellent. Excellent. I think you got him. What, what, what are your stats again? It's low strength. Medium defensive stats. Good arcane and dex. Okay. Interesting. Sure. Oh, I gotta get this volume mix out of the way. It's really annoying me. Loading. This is already feeling like a really long loading, based on previous experience with these games. Oh no, never mind. Oh. One of the reasons I will never play one of the games on consoles is because Bloodborne, and like even Dark Souls 2, had like such long loading screens, it was so annoying. Tell a story. That's a nice tree you got though. Across the fog. The lands between. Let me know if I need to boost the, the game at all. I made it fairly quiet. It can definitely be louder. Now, Queen Marika the Eternal is nowhere. Godwin the Golden was first to perish. Soon, Marika's offspring, demigods all, claimed the shards of the Elden Ring. The mad taint of their Found strength. I don't, I don't want to hear Taint be described as mad. Triggered oh, Snake. Shattering. Very sneaky. That's a nice concert art you got, though. <laughs> a war from which no lord arose. <gasps> it's the character from all the promo material. A war leading to abandonment. He's like a Valkyrie fellow. That guy's huge. Oh! Rise now, ye tarnished. That's a good sign. Who yet live? The call of long lost grace speaks to us all. I want to sample that so bad. The oh, oh! I feel like that could be important. <laughs> More alone, chieftain of the Badlands, the ever brilliant Gold Mask. Fear That's his name, Gold Mask. Okay. Companion. The 
Dung eater. Oh my god, there's some there's some characters in this. And Sir Gideon Othnia. The all knowing the few. <laughs> uh. And the furtive dung eater. So easily forgotten. <laughs> right, so these are all the bosses then. <laughs> if uh, they're following the tradition. Oh, they're doing the thing. The furtive pygmy. A tarnished of no renown. So easy. Oh, God. No, it's me. Cross the fog. Obviously. To the lands between. To stand before the Elden Ring. Ah, so this is rendered in engine. In game right now, I see. Doesn't look too laggy for me, but we'll see what it's like when they get to the open world, I suppose. Elden Lord. The Elden Lord! The game that makes you Elden Lord. <laughs> I hope there's no beach in this game. I don't, I, I don't really want to go more Elden than I already am. The ring. Oh, there's a fucking jump button? No. No, you can't do that. Jump button? They're crazy. Okay, 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 yeah. Yeah. Mm. That's, um... Maybe I should install the game on SSD. I'm a... I should have anyway, but I sort of forgot that it would be important to do. Because that feels like um, a sort of read-write issue, you know? So it feels this the, the it feels like it's buffering like uh like it's, it goes to the cache for some things and then like it'll just like a little hiccup you know as it tries to like load something from the hard drive I feel like that's not something wizard ring that's probably for finger sorry that's probably for the uh, for the online play ooh that's slick that's a slick menu menus always look garbage in these games. <laughs> Okay, yeah, I, I I get it. I understand. This this still does look, look a bit overwhelming for people that don't know what the fuck they're looking at. I think. Memory of Grace. Oh no 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 no! That's my return to checkpoint sort of thing. Okay, that's nice. But I I got a gift. Oh my god! It feels oh it's yeah. <clears throat> it's it's it, it even the menus it like lags a bit. Yeah, it does. It does. But the frame rate is alright. That's not the problem. My frame rate is totally fine. It's the loading that's a problem. But I, I picked up an item, didn't I? There, yeah, golden seed. Quick secret fast number uses. Oh, is that just a. I don't know what it is, but we'll find out. We'll find out. The point is, I don't know what the fuck anything is. I got some gestures over here. That's my ring. Let me get my ring out. I can I can swap out this, this bow for my my ring. There you go. The ringu. Excellent. That's beautiful. Uh multiplayer. Okay. The fuck is this? Well, this this looks a lot better than previous games. Multiplayer has been kind of jank in like previous games, but that looks like they've actually made it. Uh, a, I, I did hear that uh, they were wanting to make the game more interesting to play co-op with like friends and stuff, because usually it's most accessible to playing with um, to like randoms that you never see again, really. Okay, this actually runs right. This is not that bad. <gasps> it's the tree! So what have we got here? Sure, that show us a knife slash. A little big knife slashy. And a uh, parry? Okay, I, I hate the buckler parry animation. I hate it. Whoa! That's a slow dodge. What controls have we got for jumping? Oh, hang on. 
That's a freaking crouch animation. The fuck? Who put in these these animations with crouching? Who did that? Wait. Oh, of course there's no jump. I was like, wait. How do you jump in this game? Do you like run and then press B again? No, no, no. You got a jump button. <laughs> It's gonna take me forever to get used to that because before it was horrible. Like jumping in these games were like was like the most unintuitive thing ever. You had to like hold down B when you're at max speed, press B again. It's like Ugh. it made you die many times because also the jump was just kind of weird. Like the way they it didn't like make you ju it just sort of played an animation where you were slightly off the ground, so it didn't feel like you were jumping. <laughs> <laughs> like, it was so easy to just fall off shit when you were trying to jump. It really sucked. I guess it's probably like stealthiness. Oh, uh, yeah, because yeah, of course it's like crouching and stealthiness and jumping. Because this is probably based on like the Sekiro engine, I imagine. And, and that game's got like stuff like that. So just, you can just jump there. Before, you would have to like run all the way around if you had a chest high wall, or knee high wall even. If you had a curb on the floor, you wouldn't be able to get around it. What the fuck was that? Yeah, okay, yeah, there's something strange. It feels a bit strange sometimes, like the controls sort of feel a bit haunted sometimes. Um, it like kinda, I, so I changed my camera, but like it lagged as I changed the camera, so it kept like spinning my camera around like this. When, when I didn't hold the stick, which feels really cursed. If it, it feels really bad when it just your controller does things without you, you know, pressing things. Hello, have we got a tutorial boss fight? We got a tutorial fight. Oh yeah, there you are. Grafted Zion. Oh, the sun just came in. I can't see shit. There's so much glare on my screen right now, dude. Whoa, did that fucking hurt? He just screamed at me and it hurt. Oh, this is not a 100% block shield. <laughs> this this shield sucks, I just realized. Buy some, get out of here. I fixed it. Sun's gone. The sun came in at the exact right time to blind me when the fight started. Oh, that's a black screen. Have you got us a black screen? What's this black screen about? Oh, hello. Okay, I gotta, I gotta move this game to my SSD, dude. That's a nice One name. Of his kind is sure to seek the Elden Ring. Even if it does violate the Golden Order. Not supposed to, uh, to fight the Golden Order. That's against the rules, dude. I'm probably never gonna get an expansion for the Golden Orders, am I? <laughs> maybe, maybe they're like the Kingsman and call on the Golden Ring. That was one of the films, right? <gasps> Fast got Crimson Tears. I got the Healy item. Yeah, so I, I guess that was probably like a boss fight uh, where I could have won, but I died. But like, also, wow. Um, 
And that's, that, that's, that's an, a harder fight to win than usual, I feel. Uh, no, 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 no. Uh, just since, um... Uh, he had an unblockable skill, uh, which is interesting. <clears throat> Oh, no, 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 I can do this. Have they made the imagery more intuitive? No. Wait, what? How does it work? What the? Oh, map. Okay. Wow, okay. Hello. Hello, there. That's a big old world you got there. How the hell do you use this imagery? I'm actually clicking every single item. Uh, button in, even. I literally cannot find how I use a pouch. But I feel like it's very deliberate that these things are um, assigned to what looks like a D-pad, right? How do you do it? Use item... There we go. And menu, switch item... Really? No. Oh, here we go. Quick item. There we go. But what's the deal with the pouch then? How do you how do you use the pouch? Is it a Windows button? No. Oh no! no, no do not press that. Do not press that. I pre I just pressed my my like Xbox uh, thing, <laughs> Xbox button. And holy shit, it's dark. Yeah, so now I've got my items here. So now they did make the item up just more intuitive. But I don't know how to use the pouch. I have no idea. It just says D pads, right? But I, I'm, a, I'm, I'm guessing I've got to hold something before pressing the D pad, but I kind of find it. I have no idea. It's got to be someone out there that's like, this is how you use the pouch. <laughs> <laughs> There's like a whole article about it. Yeah, there's actually just nothing here about pouches. That's bizarre. Oh, you can rebind your control. That's super nice. You don't see that very often. Yeah, that's map. That's main menu. Switch item. What is the pouch about? Why is there a D-pad on the pouch? Because I, I guess the pouch is like, it's items that are always there. So you can press the pause menu, then go here. See, that, make, that, that makes some sense, right? So I guess I can go here, I can use that. That makes sense. Why is there a D-pad on it? I, I guess. Oh, there it is. You have to hold the Y button. <laughs> could have told me. Also, you could have provided me with some light. Can I get some? Can I get a torch or something? It's very dark in here, and it's even harder because, like, oh my god, the sun is so bright. It's so bright, and the glare is like staring right at my screen. Unfortunately, I'm gonna need like some sort of sunscreen here. I think. I'm gonna need to, um, another layer of curtains, I think. Uh, some nice blackout curtains. What do you say? Brave Tarnished. Take the plunge of learning and remembrance. Recall the arts of war and your warrior's blood. Oh, there is. Oh, bam, they see shit down there, dude. Can... Uh, is this another one of those games where, like, they, they bait you into uh, making the game too, um, too dark? There we go. That's much nicer. 
I feel like they trick you. Like, every time there's some game that's like, um... Yo, you should ad adjust your brightness so you can't see the logo. And every time, without fail, it, like, makes the game too dark. And it's it doesn't look good anymore. And... You just adjust the brightness all the way up, and it's like, oh, wow! I can see shit now, everything looks better. <laughs> right? I keep doing this. It's still really dark for me right now, and that, but that's just because um, the, the sun glow is, is bad. Did I just say it's too dark in here? No, neither. Neither neither, dude. <laughs> I need a freaking torch. That's what I need. Is it like slightly brighter on the stream? No, there's some sun glow in there. Even. Maybe on days like this, I should get my um, my nice some nice uh, sheets to cover the, the window <laughs> until I can get some uh, and uh, some extra curtains up there. I'll take the plunge. There's a door up there. I'll, I'll take the I'll take I'll take the plunge. Maybe I should have uh, checked the door first. Oh shit! I'm taking the plunge now. Yeah, I should have taken the door first. Sight of Grace. Bonfire. Light converges. I want to go back up there. Oh, runes! That's what, uh, that's your experience points. That's where runes are. Let's see. Oh, bye, sun! Nice. That's a nice thing about winter, I guess. Sun is annoying, but it, it also just goes away. Wait, did, did... Does a path split as soon as you load in? Okay. Stone sword key. Ah, oh, so that's if the one, one of the gifts I could have picked up. Could have got something to, to go for. Property multiplier. Finger, severer, and curled finger. Okay. I can summon some friends with that. Well, oh, okay. Let's do them. Yep, that, that looks very familiar. Past time, flasks. Uh, I'm gonna allocate flask charges, yes. I'm, I just want the red. Thank you. I just want the health. Oh! And yeah, I can um, I can use my, my thing to get more frustration because I got, I got that as a, a gift when I created my character. No, I can't. Okay. No, I can use the golden seed. I right, so I can have more charges. There we go. So it doesn't heal more, but I, I can heal more. Cool, cool, cool. I think I'm gonna use this menu here a lot. I really like this menu actually. This this patch here, and I don't know how to use it. This is super nice, super, 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 super nice. But hang on, how do I um, how do I two hand my weapon? Nope. Uh, I guess I can test this. Should have five now, right? Yes, five. Okay. So it fills up when I sit down. Cool. I would try to level, but you put a friggin' message on it, so I can't do it. No, I guess no, that that lever is for resummoning the the lift, and it's already here. Yep. But I, I don't want to go with that. So look, yes. Cool. So I can I can go up there then if I want to. I kind of want to go down here, before anything. I 
Well, I think this is like the, the tutorial zone, probably. That, that's why it's uh, a bit to the side. Side to Grace. Yep, I found you. Touch Grace. <laughs> touch Grace. It's, it kind of sounds like touch grass. Is that a joke? No, it's not a joke. It's... Oh, hello. Yeah, this is the tutorial zone now. So you can drop down here if you want the optional tutorial. Or you can just um, go up there to just get started again. Shit, it, it popped up a tutorial briefly for 200. That, that, that was a dodge. Whoa. Maybe the dodge is as fast as it used to be. It feels a little bit more unwieldy for some reason. Actually, let, uh, what's, it, uh, what's the parry like? Oh, I blocked it. This guy's slow, man. It's always uh, hard to uh, practice uh, parries with these these fellows here that just don't attack you. Fine, whatever. There might just be weapons that are two-handed in this game. Yeah, it's, it's, so, it's so slow, like, in um, in a really unpredictable way. Yeah, like, why did you not attack that? Yeah, you, can't, you can't practice parrying with these guys, it's just weird. It is all is too slow and like too weird. Yeah. <laughs> cool. Well, the seed animation is alright, but if, if you're trying to predict it, it's like they're deliberately being like weird because they're just meant to be so slow. It's easy to just kill them. <laughs> Rude. I think I got uh, I got a bow, right? Whoa, hello. Oh, that's fast. That is so much faster than like any other um, game by by from soft. See, that's not like it. That guy just attacks um, swings at you, so it's very easy to predict. Materials. I can just pick up. Berries. I don't take that. Take some rumor fruits. Oh, it, I am so black though. But the use button being being on uh, Y. That is really weird. I'm so used to it being on uh, like A. Here we go. Here we go. Switch right hand armament. Switch left hand armament. Wield two hands. Oh, I was actually correct. It is pressing both buttons. Oh, that's, that's fucking weird. That's weird. Yeah. That, okay. Yeah. That's. I'm not actually a huge fan of that, but it's yeah, it's weird. <laughs> it's fine though. Rude. So I gotta push a block at least. Can I kick? I can't kick. I can do that though. Wait, can I really not kick? Yeah, I have like no guard break or anything. That's so weird. What do you mean try jump attack? That's not in the game. Oh no, okay, that, that's that's a lot better. I thought it was I had to press both buttons on the back. I only have to press one. So hold Y, then press my attack button, then I two-handed. Okay, that's not too bad. Still a little bit more unwieldy than it used to be. It used to just be why, but I guess I like the patch well enough. Dude, you're so weird, man. I, I like the patch well enough that I'm 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 okay with the new system. Loads of people putting down signs everywhere. Only if you get uh, bonuses for people rating your signs, like you did before. You could get like, um, put on signs and the people liked the, the signs. You got like a little goodie. So it felt worth it to do. I don't have skills. Unless... I do have a skill, okay. I just gotta like two hand mana for it. Ooh? Ooh? Whoa! It like, uh, actually does a little bit of, um, poise damage. It's actually dash like that. That's neat. 
crouching. Oh yeah, stealth, stealth. You can get uh, some some backstabs, I guess. So my damage is gonna suck <laughs> for a while, but at least I'll have like high critical hits. So my damage kind of relies right now on the parries and backstabs, really. It's like just doing just doing this stuff here. It kind of sucks. It does scale a little bit with strength. Hang on, let's have a look. So this should just do a tiny bit. Oh, there we go. Oh, there we go. Stance breaking. Oh, jump attack. Oh, you just you just jump. Of course, jump attack is just jumping. I see. So instead of kicking, you have this done. So if someone's uh, got the the guard up, you just. Uh. Whoa. Okay. Wow. Okay. Interesting. So previously, it like Bloodborne, you'd have to like charge an attack like that on their back to get a backstab. But I guess you can backstab at this, but I can also do that. So that's that's strong. Okay. So bonfires will revive me, but also these statues will. Oh, so these are checkpoints. These guys here. That's neat. Okay, so they got, the, got like little checkpoints during dungeons. That's really cool. That's a good idea. Soldier of Godric. What you what you got going there? It's like a little swy handler. Can't attack immediately after blocking enemy attack. Oh, okay. That's cool. Ow, what the hell was that? He didn't attack me. He just did a, an attack on me and didn't do any damage. That was so weird. Yeah, back somewhere. Yeah, he did not enjoy that. Oh, that's so cool. And you get a backstab? That's fun. I'd really reward you then. Really reward you for, for, for doing that. That's super nice. What's that? What's that? Hello? Like the hole, so speak the hole. Well, I saw a guy from the, on the other side of that hole though. I guess you can just look for it from the other side. A lot of fellas here that died to that guy. <laughs> Silly fellas. You're not supposed to do that. Ah ha ha ha, I'm back, yeah. So, yeah, that, that's just the tutorial zone there. And it's completely optional. All you get from that is that uh, emote up there. But I learned some things. I learned a lot of things that otherwise I. V probably wouldn't have, and it would figure taking me a long time to figure out. Like that, um... Whoa, 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 whoa. Yeah, any, any time you load into a new area, it's like that. That the uh, guard break thing, I would never uh, find out about that. It's so weird that, like, it doesn't play an animation when you sit down. I'm used to, like, there, there being some kind of, like, effect, like a full screen effect when you sit down to the bonfire, and it goes like, boom, you know? Like, like, it's like a little sound effect, and you get like a little glow on the screen. You fade uh, into you sitting down, but it, it, it just... It just goes in black here, it's very strange. Uh, at least it's gonna be bright, uh, not dark out here so I can actually see things. Yeah, I can see stuff! I see now is probably a time when uh, my game is probably a little bit too bright, actually. Right. Brightness, 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 brightness. There we go. Maybe you see once the sun chills out as well. Touch grays. <laughs> 
<laughs> Grace exists to guide the tarnish and lead them along the proper path. Ah, now some sites of uh, Grace are of power. The golden rays will guide you along the way. That's that's cool. That's cool. It's kind of like the wind in some games guiding you, showing you a direction. I was wondering about that. Like, aren't you gonna feel lost in a game like this if it's an open world? Hey, buddy. Oh yes. Tarnished, are we? Oh, quiet, are we? Stands between for the Elden Ring. Of course you have. No shame in it. Unfortunately for you, however. You are maidenless. Sure am. Can't without level up. Guidance, without the strength of runes and without an invitation without to the round table hold, you are fated, it seems, to die in obscurity. What's this what's this guy up to? You look, look like a surgeon. Surgeon fellow. Um Audio, please. Can I get these uh, fellas to speak a bit louder? How's that? Luckily for you, however, it's there better. Is one shining ray of hope for even the maidenless, me, Vare. Vare. Take care to listen. Are you familiar with grace? Sure am. The golden light that gives life to you, tarnished. You may also behold its golden rays, pointing in a particular direction at times. No, oh, so this game has both kind of, kinds of guidance. tutorials, and both guys that tell you about stuff and also oh, little boxes. <laughs> so they're really making sure you actually understand the game this time around, I guess. Indeed. Grace's guidance holds the answers. It will lead you tarnished to the path you are meant to follow. Even if it leads you to your grave. He didn't even laugh at the end. Grace's guidance will castle Stormvale. Oh, the, over the, on the cliff. The home of the decrepit demigod, Godric the Draft. They know we, they already face a Godric. It's time you to castle Storm. If you seek the Elden Ring. It's time you to castle Stormvale. Is that a castle cliff, there? If you seek. That might be the castle right there. Actually, it might not be. Oh, I'll, I'm gonna fold, fold a little light here, I suppose. I'm not a huge fan of running with uh, holding the B key still, though. B button, rather. Holding the B button is kind of annoying, because uh, if while holding the B button, it's kind of awkward to change the camera around, right? So generally, when running, unless you want to do some uncomfortable stuff with your fingies, uh... You kind of have to like stop running to to to, to look around. These eagles are really chill. Can I double jump? Can I climb? You can't climb on us. Yeah, it's just, they're not letting you get get away with like the cra as crazy stuff as you did in Sekiro. Um, you can like climb on anything now. Oh, there's many trees. A bit more like ambient music in this as well, actually. It was very little in in Dark Souls. Very, very, very little. What the fuck is that? A little rock? You see? You'd only really have music in like your town, like your hub world, and then like at bosses. It was kinda kinda it. Oh, is that an item? Summoning pools. In each area you might find you may find effigies of martyrs. These effigies are summoning pools. You'll find uh, it easy to summon other players at these locations. Gotcha. There's a small golden effigy. Oh, okay, so I've activated like summoning there now. Ah, uh, is I guess that's like this uh, saying that 
that, that's where the light is showing right now. But if I wanted to, I could just run here. Yeah, very easily. I could just run down there. Is that a freaking poison swamp? I don't want to do that. That guy's gonna kick my ass, right? <laughs> That's all the. I've been looking at you, ho horse fella up here. This, this is probably an example of you don't need to kill every guy you come across, right? <laughs> <laughs> But I do need to walk past them. So, people have been saying, like, the performance issues are, like, so bad you can't play the game. So, I, I think I'm lucky. Because I'm actually streaming the game at the same time, at 1080p, 60fps. Um, which it can be taxing on a computer. And I'm getting by basically total around. So, I, I'm, I'm pretty lucky here. I think maybe this game might be... Um, a bit heavy on the uh, CPU, maybe. Because uh, I know people that have better graphics cards. Is that Santa? Better graphics cards and are um, struggling with the game. But I, I think I do have better CPUs than them because I got like an, an i7. Like a high end high se i7. Ah, oh, you already got fast travels. For your map? Wait, for real? Oh, that's nice. I can just freaking teleport anywhere. <laughs> okay. And this is showing like... Oh, so these are kind of like showing where the next uh, side of Grace is done. That's a cool system. I'm a... At a smithing table, you can spend runes and smithing stones to strengthen your armaments. Somewhere in Lands Between, you may meet a blacksmith who can make uh, e make your str armaments even stronger. Okay. Smithing stone. Oh, I can't afford anything still. Hey, buddy, elf friend. <laughs> You're a tarnished. I can see it. What is that? And I can also see that you're not after my throat. Is that a fishing rod? Purchase, no, it's an instrument. Something. I am Carly, purveyor of fine goods. Yeah, it's like a weird, um, weird like shamisen. It looks like a weird like sandshin or something. I Kale. am of a nomadic people, selling wares as I travel. The land has been tainted by madness since the shattering of the Elden Ring. It's only tarnished like yourself, who keep things from drying up entirely. Let's say you're a very welcome customer. <laughs> Lovely. Well, that's very nice to see you as well, so I can spend my souls. I don't know how many I have. I've got six and fourteen. I can buy a telescope, I can buy some rings. Cookbooks! Crafting kit. Cracked pot. Some chain armor. A shield. Looks um like it's better than mine. Okay. I can't actually compare here. Wondrous Fisic. Not imp uh, impairing knowledge in brief. Waypoint roots. I might actually buy a sh oh, I wanna buy a shield. It's not a great shield, I don't want to buy it. I'm going to buy the crafting kit. See what it's like. See what it is. Probably just buy a shit and arrows as well. Goodbye. Nice to do business. The both seems actually worth considering here. Yeah. can make various items from materials I find. Okay. Oh, I could probably buy, make um, like uh, food from the berries I'm finding, right? River Raisin. Feed to torrent to restore HP. Ah, for my horse. Oh, for my horse. Which I don't have yet. F I can make fireballs. That's fun. Mushrooms and butterflies. Rainbow stone. Thin beast bones. Yeah, so if I had more cooking recipes, they would show up in, in this menu hidden in the item crafting menu. Neat. Cool.
Am I brave enough to mess with this guy now? There's no way I can backstab this guy, right? Unless he's a friend. No, I don't think he's a friend. Because I did... I, I, I think... Um, yeah, okay. Oh, it's a boss. Okay. I think you, if you can lock onto someone, that means automatically they are disqualified from being a friend. Whoa, 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 that's no damage. That's a lot of damage. I think you just piss off here. <laughs> See ya. <laughs> Away, away! You don't want her here! <laughs> Got him. <laughs> Golden room. Probably just to get a bunch of uh, resources. What the fuck is that? What's a beacon? I did, I did not uh, look at that earlier. I gotta look at that quickly. Can I ride you? Good. What? Excuse me? Excuse? <laughs> Whoa! What's that? What's, what's that cool trick? What's that about? <laughs> oh, these guys are cool. <laughs> Roly polling around. I when I went up to that weird goat sheep deer thing, <laughs> I did not expect it to do that. <laughs> That's the last thing I expected it to do. It was a cool trick though, it like really distracted me. It was very effective for its survival that it did that. The fuck is that beacon? Oh, it's actually on my compass as well. The compass is another thing that's unusual. But I guess this world is a lot bigger, so having a compass like that uh, has more for use. Oh! Oh, I did that. That's that's really cool. Oh, and I disappeared when I go to them. That that was the, that beacon. That was that was me, messing around with the interface. Oh, that's so cool. That's really good. It's a really nice waypoint system in this one because you you can also set more than one waypoint. I feel like I, I want to write down like uh, that I saw the boss here in this area. Let's put in the waypoint or something, I guess. There's a whole bunch of like interesting areas around. If I, if I don't want to just like run to where the next uh, suggested thing is. I think I think I should, I should just start with that though. It's very smart. I can come back here. Uh, to check out the neighboring little zo zonies. So if I look at my map, I could probably... No? Okay. I was thinking maybe um, as I explored, more of the map would be like uncovered. So that I could see where I have been and where I haven't been. But I guess they're, they're putting down these like things of like points of interest around where I've been so I can see where I have been just from that or well, I can also see where it's pointing me just from the map I don't have to actually go to the bonfire and see where the light is so if I can't actually make out the light from from where I'm standing because I can't make it out from here right I can just look at the map that's super nice Hey, buddy. And well, these guys were not friendly. Yeah, follow the road. These guys are not, fr not friendly in tutorials, so they're probably not friendly here. Does a headshot do more damage? That is a headshot, I think. That's a headshot, yeah. Whoa, yeah, my, <laughs> my knife does no damage compared to my, my bow, even, actually. Yes, uh, having a lot, lot of uh, arrows will actually be the play, I think, for me. Hello. Not didn't want 
to do a trick day. Ruin fragment. I can make some of it out. I might be able to craft some of it out uh, at the Smith and but I did see I make a rainbow stem of that. Okay. I can put down a little thing that's like glowy, you know? So I can mark where I've been a bit. I can make, make, leave breadcrumbs. What's it called? Leave little breadcrumbs behind me. Not so much useful here, but what is that? It's like a dung beetle. Get back here! Teardrop Scarab. Yeah, it is like a dung beetle rolling around treasure. These are both, um, they're both Crimson and Cerulean Teardrop Scarabs. Defeat them to replenish flasks that match the type. And we cannot replenish more flasks than the maximum amount allows. Oh, okay. So if I want more, um, I want to replenish my health flask without going to a bonfire. I can just check the those guys there. Cool. Cool, cool, cool. That's a lot of fellas. I'm gonna follow the road first. Hello? Zongie? No, that's not a zongie, that's just a guy. It's a fella. Nice try, dude. Bonk! Oh, that's a stamina region, actually. Wait, what? No! Rolling is not free, is it? Huh. Can I actually roll for free? Maybe... Uh, that has to be a, an agile combat thing. I, I want to see exactly how much my... Um, like, squirrel! Hello. I want to see how much it costs to roll when I'm in combat. Hey, I'm here. Pardon me. How is it free? What? That's insane. Oops. Oh, it does not regen, though. It does not regen. If you're... Uh, if you're rolling. So that's one way it's not free. But yeah, that legitimately makes the combat, like, so much easier, actually. There's a lot of things already that made the combat just like a ton easy in this game to manage. Because the way these games kind of work is that like you have the stamina, um, but to like manage how much damage you can do to an enemy, how much you can fight. So ideally, you just want to like mash attack, like constantly, just never stop attacking. Oh, it just be some of them. It's just some of the bunch of dudes. Uh, all right. I should probably kill him before he does that one. You just want to like attack non-stop. If you, if you could, that would be great. But enemies kind of like do attacks at you, so you have to like respond to that. And uh, so what they do is that they kind of force you in previous games to use your stamina in ways that you don't want to spend it. You want to spend it with just attacks, but they're like, nah, actually you got to use your stamina to like dodge. And that like slows you down a, a lot. So you got to like figure out how to... Um, uh, how to manage it in such a way that you uh, don't dodge too much and waste the stamina too much, you don't attack too much, but also don't attack too much, you waste the stamina so you can't dodge. So they kind of like just make that whole like uh, decision making a lot easier if it's dodging is just free. I might have gotten it wrong though, it might not be free and I'm just not paying attention. Oh, I got a buff when I, I can. Um, Resurrected the Shrine of America. That's cool. It's cool to know. Can I just walk around? What? I can kind of just walk around, but it's not quite as good as before. Because <laughs> he actually went through my, my block there. I did help hold my block up. But since he attacked my back, where I wasn't blocking, it didn't count as a block. Whereas in previous games, I think that would count as a block. Oh, 
Oh, incredibly generous timer on on that uh, follow up move. You can do that. You can wait like two seconds or something, and like it, it'll still do it. Okay, no, no, block. No, dodging is not free. Dodging is not free. Okay, no wait. So that that what I described is, is still an effect on. It's just there are times when you're out of combat, and you quickly go out of combat as well. Yeah, see, I'm already out of combat already, so it's free. I think they still have done things to make the combat easier, though. It does. It does feel just kind of more forgiving than usual. Oh, that was the whole backstab animation as well. Come on. Oh, he can do that as well. So you gotta be really careful when they're hitting an enemy's uh, block them. Okay. That was weird. Ouch. Ow. Okay, I'm getting the fuck out of here. This guy, that guy's rock hard, dude. <laughs> Where was my bonfire even? Oh, I can just check. Well, I can't check in the combat, though. It's back door. It feels pretty easy just to run away from guys. <laughs> oh, I can I can buy some of the recipes though. I got I got some extra runes though, so I can I can spend it at Vendor. Oh, the lighting is really nice in this. Look at that. That looks great. Ah, I'm so sour I didn't get a backstab on that uh, guy though. That would have helped me so much to get that. Hey, buddy. Nope, I've <laughs> tried to drink from the basket. Well, you're back. Care to buy something? I'd like to buy... What would I like to buy, actually? Warrior's cookbook. Missionary's cookbook. I'm gonna buy this and see what it, what, what it contains. Oh, there's a torch here! There's a bunch of stuff I would actually like, uh, really like. Oh, I could've just fast travel to the bonfire. I, I forgot. I don't have to run to bonfire 7. There's no need to like faff, you know, to just like if you to just get healing. So my crafting suit look different now, maybe. Doesn't look different. Do I have to use it? Nope. I guess I just don't have any of the materials required then. So my healing, yeah, I'm a bit healed now. I may also just buy a bunch of arrows for me. Because I, I'm not a huge believer in using the knife too much. I re well, Hang on, do, you don't sell a sword or anything, do you? No, no it doesn't. Goodbye. Yeah, so I, I should really be focusing on using uh, the, the bow if I can't just get a backstab here, I think. I can... no, I can't. I, uh, uh, I thought maybe for a second I could uh, uh, upgrade my knife a little bit if I want to get some more damage, but I did only get one material still. It would have been nice if I got an indicator when I was in backstab rage. Maybe I don't know. Sekiro does that. 
So I was actually waiting uh, a little bit when um, approaching enemies behind them to see if I could get, back get backstabbed. But it never appeared and I was so confused, I was so blagged because I was waiting for a little dot to show up. Usually there's like a little... Uh, you you woke up and like, I think that, I think like this, this shows up a dot behind them. And once you got a dot, you know you can backstab them. God, that, that damage is poor. How about this though? That did a little damage, didn't they? Hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. Hang on. Knife, knife, knife. What you got, though? Critical. No, oh, why did they do that? Oh, there it is. Passive effects. Cause of blood, loss of buildup. Yeah, so I do low damage. But against, like, flesh packs like this. Uh, that are, have some bleed weakness. I do re get rewarded for just hitting them a bunch of times. Like that. There we go. Mushroom. Ooh, I need a mushroom. What the fuck is this? Groveside Cave? There's a grace here. Am I even going... No, I'm not going to... Uh... The place uh, the game suggested. So I, I just sort of happened upon this. Okay. What's this then? Oh, I wish I had the torch right now. Oh, it's wolf hell. Let's go to the place to send it for this, I guess. Oh, I can also move around a little bit while aiming as well. Whoa, he's jumpy! He's, he's kind of dumb, though. <laughs> ow, 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 ow. Sudak net! Oh, the dodge attack is really good. Like, dodging and then attacking it feels really strong with the bow. God, it's so dark in here. I don't know where I am. <laughs> I have no idea. I would have taken on those guys with a knife, I think, those wolves. They did seem to take a decent amount of damage. But... <laughs> three wolves while I'm doing this little damage is not great, so... That's kind of the benefit of the bow. Although I have no, no arrows at all. They haven't made, like... The bow a lot stronger. In this than, like, most other uh, FromSoft games. But... Um, arrows feel a lot more expensive. A lot more expensive. So I guess that's a, that's a trade-off. Arrows used to be like dirt cheap before because like the yeah, bows are kind of like worthless. But in this, the uh, bows might actually be viable. So you gotta make the uh, the arrows a bit more expensive. So it's not like totally free to have to be ranged because that's a big benefit. Cracked pot. No, you're a crack pot. Rude. Thin beast bones. What's that for? Whoa, there's two of them! I'm freaking dead, dude. No, I'm not. I'm fine. Totally cool. Don't worry about it. I'm looking fine. <laughs> Don't worry about it. Are you worried? I'm not worried. Golden room. Silver firefly. Oh, there's a bunch of them. Oh my god. Well, whatever they are. Good thing I uh, had a sign though. So I, I don't know if I would have seen them. Ah, oh, the sun is like so indecisive behind me, man. So indecisive. Can't make his mind up whether or not he'll have peaced out or not. I just wanted to be evening already. That's the pains of being an afternoon streamer. Oh, hello. 
If I go through here, I'm not going to be able to just warp out. Strong foe ahead. Oh, okay, so if you're in a cave, it scratches out the, uh, the, the, the your thing. As a boss fighter, I don't think it's time just yet. The wolves could climb up here. I don't think it's time for me just yet to do a boss fight. I think uh, oh, it's so dark. I would I would really like to have more arrows and also more healing. I'm gonna try the. Um, can I teleport from here? No. You gotta be outside. If you're outside, then you can teleport. Oh, you can teleport, teleport kind of inside, though. I'm gonna try this. Oh, you do go into go the loading screen, though. Oh, but it's not long. Okay, so there's an initial long loading screen. After that, you're fine. Don't worry about it. Cool. <laughs> I'm always gonna jump in front of these guys because I, I, I keep thinking that's the use button. Give me the torch. Then give me like just a ton of arrows. Goodbye. Can I craft bombs? Yes. Let's try this. Let's see what uh, see how good the bombs are in this. Sometimes the bombs are super good, sometimes they're worthless. Uh, but if we're early on in the game, and that's usually when bombs might be crazy good. Might be. What's the damage on this? Actually, not garbage. Actually, not not total garbage. The animations might not be great though. They're fine. They're slow. Oh! That's a quick way to the boss. Beastman of Farumazula. Hey, bud. I reckon I can parry this guy. He's weird. He's doing some weird shit, man. Shit. Wish I had that shield right now. Some damage. Missing though. Missing this guy specifically because he's so low to the ground. Go to the jumpy attack. Crumbs really fast. I'm countering a problem with how, uh, how much you miss with this. Oh, a headshot when it's upright though. <laughs> Got 
got the auto aim headshot. That is really funny for this guy. It's got its head at a really awkward uh, position, and his face looks it seems huge. <laughs> That's so cheesy, man. <laughs> Blame Drake Talisman? What is that? Oh, I guess that's a little dungeon you can do. Teleport the entrance. What a shield. Oh, Talisman, that's like an, um, like an item slot. Boost fire damage negation. Yeah, I'd say. Talisman depicting a, a red ancient dragon. The ancient dragons who ruled in the prehistoric era before the Erd Tree would protect their lords as a wall of living rock. And so it is the shape of the dragon has become symbolic of all matter, all manner of protections. This is nice. I like this. So, um, you got two slides to an item. You got one that just tells you what it is, and you got one that's got uh, some description. They're not like fucking around now, where you have to like read an item and like find what it, the effect somewhere in the, this, the same page as the item description. They divide it so that it makes sense. I thought like that's good. This feels really good to play. It's uh, definitely like. Uh, really slick. Feels really tight. It um, doesn't feel cheap at all compared to like what Dark Souls, for instance, did. Dark Souls, in some instances, felt really kind of cheap. But after like Dark Souls three, uh, like the 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 game has started feeling really expensive, like really premium. Hello, Lord's on straight sword. Can't use that though. Need uh, more dex. Uh, more strength. But I can't get more strength. I'm actually like very locked into um, uh, my stuff right now because I, I don't have the means to level up. I can do this though. Yes. Okay. That that works the same way. So if you do, if you two ha two hand an item, you get twenty percent more to twenty five percent more strength. So I can get uh, the last strength I need. What sort of weapon is this? Just regular damage. What's your... Ah, that's that's a skill nut. Squ square off. Root resin. Does that like apply poison to your weapon or something? No, it's a crafting material. Okay. I can do this, and they can do heavy attack or light attack, and then it'll do a different follow up depending on which one I press. It's alright, I think. Awesome spot. If I could get a um, crossbow for one of these guys, that would be fantastic. Because I'm getting a lot of bolts right now. Loads of bolts. So I have plenty of ammo for a crossbow. I feel like you could load a bolt into a bow, can you? Oh, oh, are you like nighttime enemies? I did see these bats in uh, another area. But I didn't see them in this area here before. Does that cost uh, mana to do? No, no, it does not cost uh, any uh, focus at all. Oh, that's a grabby. Oh, that's a lot of build. Build up. Build up. Build up. No, thank you. Yes, yeah, so there's really no reason not, not to do that. Oh, actually, ah, oh, shit. I, I'm, I'm loath to kind of leave right now. Already. But I, I want to go here. Because you got a bunch of um, money. 
We're killing the boss. So I can buy a shield. And, uh. I can buy a telescope. This, I have it. I'm, gonna need, I'm probably going to use it, but I have it now. Goodbye. There you go. Used all my money. <laughs> I'm a very smoke a divvy garden sort of guy. <laughs> I don't care about saving the stuff. I'm just going just gonna to spend it. I do have some uh, currency saved up, like banked, I think, right now. Oops. Um, but that is... Having, like, banked uh, currency in these games is like, very premium, so I'm going to save it until I can level up, at least, I think. It probably makes sense for me to just rest up until daytime, so I don't have to deal with bats, right? Oh, these guys are really oblivious. So you don't... I really have to worry too much about, like, stealth. Because these guys are kind of blind. Kind of deaf, kind of <laughs> not really sensing anything around them at all. What is that? It's an item, though, I think. Might be a crafting material. That's got kind of what I'm learning, is that if I see something glowing in a certain way, that seems like a crafting material. Yeah, room fragment. <laughs> now let's try this then. I don't want to find the bats. Might have to know it. Nah, they're blind! They have no idea I'm here. Oh, I can't cr both crouch and run. That's nice. Wait, well, I've got some buff. What's his buff on me? Can I tell? Nope. No idea. I got three buffs up there, but I cannot tell it down. I think you got a stamina regen buff. I don't know why, but I, th I, think, that, I think that's what I got. Because I'm like glowing gold. Oh, I'm not glowing gold anymore. Yeah, I lost the buff. I lost the hand. It was like a glowy hand on me. I can kill this guy. I said that guy, uh, he's got a trumpet. Is it possible? I would like to sneak kill him. And then I can get the lance guy who was being a big jerk. Huge jerk. Ooh, hang on. I got another shield. I'm gonna buck the parry. This is faster than regular parry. It's faster than regular parry, but uh Oh god, she's got a fucking chill. But um does it have is it like still as active though? More strength, but what does it do? No skill? That sucks. It's so heavy as well. 16 strength. Commonly employed in the shattering. Large side for a medium shallow size shield, the face has been covered in brass. If someone has no skill, the dominant uh, in the other hand has a skill, this that skill will be used instead. Oh, that's good. Okay, that's uh, th it is good then if an item doesn't have a skill. Yes. It means it's u easier for me to use my knife skill. Because right now, I don't really care if my knife is really one handed or two handed. It doesn't make a huge difference for me because it's not a strength weapon. Uh, so. I could use that to just use the knife skill, which is dash around faster, which is right. It's really good in like swamps. This guy's strong, dude. This guy doesn't fuck around. There's two of them? No, that's a, that's a regular good. Well, I got the partial block, but no parry. It's always hard to do parries when you're not totally familiar with the animation they're doing, you know? This guy is just squaring me off, man. He's waiting for dudes to sort of come closer. There we go, thank you. 
shit. Thank you. That's my only really consistent way of killing people uh, like this is they're not shit. It really chased my, my dodge though. That did not do as much damage as I hoped. Oh, the bats are here. No, not the bats. Go away, bats! You don't want it here! God damn it. You're really ruining everything right now. I was, having, I was just about to kill that guy. Jeez. It's still there, though. Thank you. Magician enemy groups. With pressure flasks. Cool. Okay, nice. Whoa, 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 whoa. Yeah, I got one more flask there. That's nice. Come on, dude. You know you wanna. Got him. I better become wealthy from killing that guy. He was a jerk. He had so much health. <laughs> I really struggled with parrying as well. I couldn't do it. I just could not see like when anything was coming out from him, man. I think I really need to use the bucket for a while. Even though it is worse at blocking. And I, mean, I, I, I want to see like how, be how much better I am at. Um, uh, Pairing with it, because pairing is so important. Oh, that's how you um, get rid of the fog. You just find maps. Yeah, it looks much nicer. I was, I was really confused. I was looking at the map, I was like, why does this map look like shit? <laughs> yeah, that's much more like it. That's a, that's a cool map. That was a parry, buddy. That was a parry, buddy. Come on. Okay. Yeah, the, um... The buckler is mad active. It has mad active frames. When it's a parry or not. That was parrying really early. That was a fast move. Dude, th th those, those swings. Really, really fast. Stop that! What? I will, I will, okay, bow time. Shit. There's a wall here. <laughs> Herba. Herba. I thought it was gonna attack me with the, um, the torch again, and they just whacked me with the maze. He just like attacked me with the, the, the like his torch. Like six times before he decided to attack me with his actual weapon. It bugged me out and he just killed the shit out of me with it. Oh, fuck. That's, that's a guy. That's a fella. It traded! <laughs> he had the helmet on. Oh, I didn't think it was gonna reach me though. I was like, I'm gonna wait for him to stab me. And then I'm gonna do dodge back and shoot him. And punish his uh, helmet stab. And it tra I didn't think it was gonna reach me. I. 
How many pricks did that uh, resurrect Medina? If it's all of them, I'm gonna be a bit, a bit uh, dismayed from exploding this place because uh, I'm having a hard time like cleanly killing all of them. This trumpet guy. Mainly, I'm, I'm, um, I'm thinking about the uh, the lance guy. Lance guy's still there. Lance is still here. Don't you though? I see. So if if he gets a hoot just a little bit, that that's bad enough. But if he just summoned everyone to that location, that I can run, I can run here quickly because they're all gone. I right, wolves don't care about horns, is the thing. I should just swipe at the enemies. Well, I, I'm trying to be too cute, I think. I'm trying to do dumb shit when I can just slash, slash at things until they bleed. <laughs> skills. With a wet sun knife, you can use axes of war to grant armaments and new skills as size of grace. Armaments can only have one skill. It will remove previous skills. Once type of what skills you can have. That's really cool. You can alter the moments. Attack and affinity, boost attribute scaling and more. What's a knife? Okay, so that's, you can customize weapons then. Be like, no, I want this to have different skills or different stats. So that's uh, you can kind of choose what weapons uh, weapons uh, fit your, your build and playstyle a bit more. That's very neat. This. Enemies are super dumb in this. The, a horn might be sounded, and they'll all come to to get you. But you can also do they'll also just as quickly forget you below. Ouch! Do it, you won't. Come on, Rami, Rami, buddy, do it. That's not a ram. It was way faster than I thought it was gonna be. Shit! He is so he's got so many variable different like speeds on his attacks. How did that not parry? That one I like. I can I can predict that one. Everything else I'm like so blagged off. What the hell is this? Fuck, I could have backstabbed him there if I didn't try to parry. What? Okay, I give up. That blew my mind. So much so that I'm just like... I'm, I, I, just did, I didn't think it was worth it to fight a guy anymore after I saw that happen though. He just attacked my parry animation. And it was just like, I'm not parried. And and so it was so, you know. Oh, the bonfire is right there! It's right there! <laughs> that makes me so much easier if I want to explore this camp. Don't do it, dude. Gonna walk around you. Oh! I'm gonna keep walking around you. There we go. <laughs> but the lance guy down there is not as easy to do that on one. 
This has too much HP. I don't want to worry about the last guy. This has got too much HP and I'm doing way too little damage. It's a friend. Hello. Welcome. I'm just chilling here. Waiting for someone to give me some levels. Greeting. Are you such a person that it's going to grant Traveler. me some levels? From beyond the fog, I am Melina. I offer you an accord. Is it an accord I cannot refuse? Have you heard of the finger maiden? Excuse me? They I thought this was more of an, a, a, a classy game. Offering guidance and aid to the tarnished. But you, I am afraid, are maidenless. I can play the role of maiden. Turning runes into strength to aid you in your search for the Elden Ring. You need only take me with you to the foot of the Erd Tree. Joe, sure. I can refuse you? Okay. Summon me by grace to turn runes into strength. Ah, the runes, though. I bequeath to you this ring. Is it of the elder kind? That's the only one I care about, sorry. Spectral steed. Oh, we got the Use steed already. Nice. To traverse great distances. It will summon a spectral steed named Torrent. Torrent has chosen you. Treat him with respect. Shall I turn your runes to strength? Absolutely. Let my hand rest upon you. For but a moment, share them with me. Your thoughts, your ambitions, the principles you would. I don't know if I actually need endurance. Stamina feels so forgiving in this. Right, so this is if I want to replace skills. I'm good. I don't have any spells though. No incantations for me. I have two slots though. Uh, pouch would be a uh, natural place, I think, for um, my whistle to go. There you are. And I got two slots as well for just using quick having shortcuts in my imagery. That's nice. Oh Okay. It's multiple varieties of co-op on this game. You got signs that you can put down. That's delightful. And you can also be summoned at the shrine so people will know the um They'll find some people. That was excellent. Alright, there's gotta be some stuff here. In this camp still. I wanna... Um, pop my rune stones. And see if I can get some more levels. Uh, well, I would, but I don't see where they are. That's weird. Oh, I've, I've been to, I do craft it and all that. 400. Two hundred. 
don't think it's a level. 775. Well, I'm gonna kill some dudes. Then, then that'll be enough. Oh, he didn't see anything. Yeah, these guys are real thick. <laughs> I think it's because they're like undead. It's like grotty looking fellas. Oh, I, I wonder something actually. How much can you cheese the stealth on us? That's something worth checking out for this kind of thing. It's like a, uh, an easy way to do a ton of damage. Shit, I didn't lock into that. Oh, whoa, whoa, I didn't even see you! Oh, you're backstab. Oh, wait, oh, you. That's not a new enemy. It just didn't die after backstab them. Yeah, the easy way to do a ton of damage is to backstab them before they know you die, right? So. <laughs> how quickly do they forget? I might be too far away here. Yeah. I can do this. And then just run away. Just like it. I'm out of here. Is that just a guy just gonna stay at his current health level and just start wandering around this patrol? Oh my god, he is. Oh my god, immoral. Absolute rube. That guy is patrolling towards me though. Is he gonna warn his friend? Nope. <laughs> Not in time anyway. <laughs> oh, that's so cheesy. Nah, that's not as two of them though. This is getting out of hand. You didn't see a thing. I was never here. I was never here. It's gonna chase me this one. Fine, I'll just uh, give, it, give it a little rupert of them. No! Godric Knight Gauntlets. There is a cripplet in this game, right? There is. There is. Oh, and it actually tells you what sort of load you got. Medium load. Does, is, does that imply the existence of light load? I see. It does. It does. This this is... This is a way faster roll, I think. Uh -huh. Compared to... Uh -huh. It's not a slow roll, though. It's not a slow roll. Okay, so leveling endurance is actually pretty good on if you can manage to get the light load, because um, that that's probably got you like a, a, a better roll with more iframes and stuff. It's really good. And just having more stamina is always uh, brilliant as well, actually, because uh, blocking seems good in this game. Not for me right now, because my shield is crap. <laughs> but if I had a better shield. I think pretty good. Davos a parry, dude. Am I um, parrying too late, actually? Mm. Oh, no, no. Okay, no, I'm not. I'm not. I'm parrying at the right time. It's just uh, that my timing is slightly off. Especially the. I might be more used to regular shields, honestly. I am. I definitely am. Rude. One. Oh, 
There it is. I'm not feeling too confident about my parries. It's not as consistent as uh, I like them to be. Oh, I got my levels I want to do. And I got to explore this area here as well. I need to remember I can actually like, jump around. I'm just not used to this at all. That I just have a jump button. I get to do this. It's very strange. But I think that's the whole camp exploder now, right? So many enemies here. God, I got so much stamina as well. God, so many fucking enemies. Oh, you're so slow. God, there's no damage. <laughs> no fucking damage, man. <laughs> the damage is heavily offset by having bleed on it. Which is nice, but bleed goes down. If you don't apply bleed, um enough, it does just eventually uh, peel off. And then you have to like reapply it, so bleed kind of assumes that you're going to be able to like hit things for a long time and then like uh, not be interrupted at all by an enemies. And it probably definitely are going to get interrupted a little bit, so it's not as easy to apply bleed as one would hope. Yeah, I think that's actually the whole camp. It wasn't that important for me to like kill all camp and everything, but I, I just wanted to see if there's any items. Just to like get an idea of like where stuff is in this game. Oh no, no, there is stuff. Yeah, there is stuff though. That is Feels like it's gonna be a really cheesy way to kill things once I uh, have like a better shield. <laughs> That's what I was uh, saying with blocking feeling like a way strong option on this. Is that uh, blocking isn't just exclusively a defensive option, but you can also uh, attack back. That's very really, really cool. Oh, well, hang on, what's that? What's that? Is that a ruin fragment? No, it's just a skull. Oh, the skulls have items in them. I should crack them open. I see. Well, better than that, we can go and die if we want. I think I do want to put it first. I want to see if she shows up. It doesn't. Does it show up if I start here leveling up? Nope. Wait. I guess you, you, you don't always get that sort of interaction with the the person that levels you up. But you, you can't just level up at any bonfire, though. So that's, that's, that feels quite uh, old school. That's what Dark Souls did it. Well, Demon Souls actually didn't let you do that. The fuck was that? Hello? Are you a friend? Ow. Okay, that's that's a friend to the zombies. Let's try this one. Hmm. Oh shit, did my mount just take damage though? I think it did. 
and being very greedy and trying to loot all the items I see. Herba. I wonder if Herba heals me with this. I think they're quite easy to run, out to run a couple of enemies. Uh, like this. Whoa, the screw me though. Yeah, my um, my man definitely has uh, its own health. And some things actually just hit uh, the mounted that hitting me. Hello, James. Have I Elden the Ring yet? Uh, I got an A ring. It's not a ring I could equip, but um, it's a ring that um, I summoned this, this mount. Dude, have you seen? The roly polies? Have you seen the roly polies? I don't know how to make him roly poly, but. No, don't do that. Rude. Dude, I love the roly polies. That's astonishing. I think it's like the, um, the fawns. That's what you call, um. What do you call a female sheep again? Or like a female goat? Not a fawn. What is the name for him? I think they're the ones that do it. The, the, that's the one that did it for me earlier, uh, at least. The goats be rolling in poly, yeah. Oh, do, oh, do all of the goats? What the fuck is that? It's a rockworm! They can ignore you. Storm heal ever. Jail. Gaul. That is just pronounced jail, right? So how do I get off you? I did find a button to just get off you earlier. It's a quick dismount button. I don't see it now. I guess it is it just um this. Do I have to do that? Oh yeah, I was I was about to ask about that. Yeah, you um, you have some performance issues. Yeah, into the average. Uh, like, uh, did you just have frame drops? Like, um, what, what was, uh, up with your game? What, what didn't run right? Because I, I've, I've had some issues, but not, not so substantial ones. You got, it's all one right done. I have, like, l very light hiccups. Uh, which feels associated with loading. If I, at the start of, like, a zone, I'm, like, loading the zone, I get, like, little hiccups, and, um, I... I get these moments where um, my, my 